both of us, it was like our highest dream role was to be, well, just any part of Wicked really, and then obviously to to get to play Glinda and Fiora in the original Australian cast of Wicked was just completely life-changing. Mills and I met in the audition room for yeah. Wicked. I remember meeting Lucy Durack, she dressed as Glinda, and I looked around the room and I went, Oh, just stop looking. You found it. I don't know why you're looking at anyone else. You have got. I hadn't even heard you sing it. And I was like, she's she's the one. She's Linda. Um, for, I did four auditions over the, the course of like four months. Um, I think my first audition was 2007, November. To this day, February the second is my most favourite day of the year. It's not my birthday. It's not a. It's, a, it's the celebration of Wicked. It's the day that my manager came around and said, "You booked Wicked with a bottle of champagne," and I. Well up every time, because it changed my life. For good. For good. For good. Very good, very good. Um, yeah, without, I was, I was literally fear of, for my whole existence up until that moment. I was dancing through life um, until I found my real purpose, and I feel like it was the family of musical theatre. And since then, you know, I've gone and done a few shows for you, Frosty O'Pears, yeah, yeah. currently in Hairspray, if you want to come down to Melbourne. <laughs> um, it is such a wonderful show that brings people together. Without Wicked, there is no Frozen. And without Frozen and Wicked, there is generations of boys and girls thinking that there still needs to be a prince to save the day. But it's the, the story of friendship um, is the thing that really perpetuates love and yeah. community. And it's beautiful that it's a story, I think what drove a lot of people to the theatre, it's a story of female friendship, which really hadn't been yeah. presented on, in, no, a, in a major way in the way that Wicked did. And it's so beautiful that that's what it's about. It's about how you know women can support women and um, and make each other better. And of course, it's good versus evil and being green or misunderstood and all those sorts of things. But at the heart of it, it's just a really beautiful story. And I, to this day, I reckon at least once a week, I have somebody come up and say, "Oh my gosh, I saw you in Wicked. I love Wicked. It was the first time I saw anything." And I always think, "Oh, well, that's gonna." <laughs> That's disappointing for you because nothing's going to be as good as that. <laughs> it's all downhill. No, but it, you know, it really brought a whole new generation of theatre goers to the theatre, and and, and we're, we are still reaping the benefit. And, and I, I think it came at the right time for our industry as an industry too, because it was the return of the big blockbuster musical. Yeah.